show you that when it's got a green solid bar, it's ready to work. You press new scan. And uh, it basically does a 360 revolution mm -hmm. and should start, depending on how it's configured, you can scan only, you could image only, or you can scan an image. Yeah, okay. So right now I believe it's in scan an image. Yeah, it turns, it does, it the images, it turns 35 degrees at a time. So it does, in a full revolution, it does. It's basically catching, capturing a swath of image. It, it's, as, as the images come in, it adds to the uh, to the, the scan, and you'll notice like now you can see you've got some yeah some stitching issues. But once the once the imagery is done, then the they correct the panorama using depth based uh, using a depth based stitching algorithm, and then you get rid of that. Yeah, this comes all by itself. Yeah, and yeah. it's also the right now we're we're just still tightening everything up so the auto uh, exposure is in. We don't have the, the, uh, the high definition uh, HDR camera functionality is going to be it's a few weeks out. So, all right, so it's, it is, it is now it's starting to scan. Light comes on and then it will do, um, takes about two minutes or so to scan and transfer the data. And then you, then you have everything right here on the iPad. Is this the camera? There are three cameras. There's three cameras. And the, yeah, the, the lower one is the infrared. Oh, okay. So that's that one there. And the, the two, these two above it are the digital, the five megapixel color. And this white light, it's got that's a flash. So there are three LED flashes, one per camera. And how far out?